The Grepser Data Platform is a complete solution to acquire quality data at scale. It enables seamless collaboration between project teams, automates data extraction, delivery routines, and augments our capacity to deliver quality. To begin with, go to platform.grepser.com. Once you log in, you'll find yourself on the projects page, which contains a list of projects associated with your organization. You can search for projects using the project name, report name, or their respective IDs. If you are a manager, you have an option to view my projects and all projects. To create a project, click the start a project button, name your project, select the frequency and add requirements like the URL of the website, fields that you want to extract, and further information if necessary. You can also invite your team members using their email addresses. After creating a project, you'll be redirected to the collaboration section, which is a messaging channel. Now, let's see how we can run a crawler. In order to run a crawler, go to a project with reports and select the report for which you want to initiate a run. Click on Start a New Run. On clicking Start a New Run, a pop up appears where you can select parameters, if any, and then click on Run Report to initiate the crawler. You can view a summary of all the runs associated with a report on the datasets page. To preview the data of a particular run, just click the run date time on the first column or the eye icon in the actions column. If you want to view trends of the quality drivers like rows, accuracy, and fill rate, you can simply click any of the respective links. To download your data, expand the actions menu and click downloads. Next up we have a run level dashboard that displays the trends of the runs based on the preferences you select. On the dashboard page, apart from the trend, you can also view the data distribution, accuracy, and fill rates. To view data distribution, the columns must be indexed, and to view the accuracy, validation rules must be added. This can be done in the data schema section. All you need to do is select a field and add an index and a validation rule. Great! Now you'll be able to view the distribution and accuracy scores from all future runs of this report. For automatic data extractions and deliveries, you might want to set up your crawlers to run at specific times. For this, we have a feature called Schedule. To set up a schedule for a report, specify the start date, time, and frequency. Give a suitable name to the schedule and click on Schedule Crawl. You can find the existing schedules to your right. Each schedule can be edited, deleted, or paused as per your requirements. Once a crawl run is complete, all the data will be delivered to your preferred delivery destination in the format that you have specified. You'll have to navigate to data delivery and additional configurations. The first thing that you need to do is specify the file format. You can select as many file formats as you need and click Save. Next, you will have to select the delivery destination from the list of options available. Again, you can have your data delivered to multiple destinations. Last, but not the least, you can manage your team by navigating to the Teams menu. You can assign a role to your team members, either manager or viewer. Unlike viewers, managers have the privilege to invite and remove users, upgrade viewers to manager, add and remove projects from other members' account,